assalamu alaikum friends in this video we are going to talk about how to create uh, Udo custom add-ons this video uh, can be very lengthy so we decided to divide uh, this video into parts so in the first part uh, we are going to create an empty custom add-on and in the second video we uh, are going to add some uh, models and fields uh, in the uh, in the module and uh, then we will install it to check the effects of uh, the module of the custom module so uh, if you haven't subscribed uh, our channel please uh, click this subscribe button to get uh, updates for the upcoming videos so let's uh, uh, come back to the Udo custom add-ons development mm, first of all uh, we are going to create a custom directory for uh, our custom add-ons so that uh, we can keep it uh, separately and uh, it didn't mix up with the uh, Udo default modules so first of all we are going to create uh, a custom directory in order to create a custom directory click uh, right click here and then click directory so custom add-ons like this and then uh, inside this directory we will create uh, a directory for our custom module so uh, the naming uh, of custom modules is uh, totally uh, dependent on you but the standard uh, you need to follow some standard like uh, if you want to extend the sales module you need to specify like sales extensions or sales customizations so you need to add the name same as the feature you want to add to that module for example i want to customize the uh, sales module so i will add uh auto discussion sales auto discussion or channel name and sales so uh you cannot specify the same name is the Udo default modules so this is our custom add-ons directory and then i will create uh, a manifest file so in order to do so right click and then new and then click the python file so the naming for um, manifest file is uh, standard and you need to follow it without if you uh, if you don't uh, specify the name like this then it will not work so add two underscore and then manifest and then two underscore and then uh, py it will be specified as a python file click yes and uh, then cancel we don't want to add it into the git so this is the uh, manifest file so that quad parameter that we need to add here uh, are uh, what you need to do you need to add these breakers and then uh, specify the name of the module uh, or do for example sale extension i want to extend the sales functionality and then the version of the module the version of the module is 13.0.01 for example I want to develop this module for uh, version 13 so I will uh, add 13.0.01 like the version is 01 and the purpose of, of and the module development is for version 13 and then uh, we need to define the author like who is the uh, developer so we will add Udo discussions and then uh the name of the website or the link of the website is uh www.ododiscussions.com and then uh the dependence dependency i will just explain it later uh and then data and then installable installable sorry. true so so uh, we have to define the author name and then the website you can add whatever website uh, link uh, you want and then depends in the depends uh, we have to add uh, 
the module name for v of which the we want to extend the functionality is uh, we want to extend the functionality of a sales module so we will add a sales here sales here in the data file we need to specify the um, xml files the data files and the xml views we will explain it later and then uh, the next uh, file which is needed is the init file we need to click uh, the python file the init file uh, naming structure is like uh, 200 score and then init and then 200 score and then dot ui so click cancel so this is the init file and then we need to add a directory for uh, models create directory for models and then inside the models is we have to add the python file so we will add uh, an init file inside the models so init file underscore init the two underscore and then ui files so and then after that uh, inside the o od sales um, uh, directory we have to add the views so and so this is the basic structure uh, of odo module uh, inside the uh, models directory we have to add our uh, uh, our um, python files uh, in which we will add and extend the udo models so i will add uh, say like product extension that py so this is our first py file uh, we have added and uh, here uh, I will add a comment uh, Odoo models. So here we will define the Odoo models, and here uh, in the init file, I will import this py file from dot import uh, product extension. So this is the uh, format we can import the uh, py file in the init uh, file. And in and in the module and outside this we have another init file which where we have to uh, import this uh, models folder. For example, from dot import models. So and then so this is uh, just an empty module. And in the next video we uh, are going to add the custom add-ons path and we will install the module. Thank you.